what's up guys today i'm back with another video okay this time i'm going to be playing doing another minecraft video i know i haven't done one of these in a long time but as you can see from the title i am going to be showing you how to make your own style of cabin see it's different than all the other videos because people oh no like okay because people show how to make theirs not tips on how to make your own so right now, or the first tip, major tip, is to clear out a space before you do something like this. And also, what I am going to do is I'm also going to be putting in a tutor tutorials on things. So, okay, I don't know why it's lagging so much, but it's fine. Okay, so just go up here. So take out your wood of your I don't know why he keeps doing this now take out the wood of your choice or yeah actually wood mainly take out, I'm just gonna use oak you gotta be kidding me I, I'm so sorry it's not supposed to be doing this don't act up you're don't act up switch you're embarrassing me in front of my viewers okay okay yeah so and also before you start what you need what you you really need to do is you need to oh you need to use your or tear okay you need to terraform why is it lagging so much this is going to be a painful video Okay, so you make the spot you want flat, unless you want to, okay, stop it, I'm serious now. Okay, so you make it flat, the area you want flat, and if you're making some sort of really tall type of cabin, and you want to terraform that, that's for a different video, maybe, if I'm going to do that, but I'm not sure. But that's for, that's a different story. So... What you first want to do is you want to find you want to find your dimensions. So you can I guess I will put four blocks going up here, then spread out a little, maybe. Oh, you got to be kidding me! I am so sorry for this. I'm gonna talk to to um switch after we're done. Don't worry about it. No. See, and uh, by the way, you want to find somewhere over, like, over that. Why are you doing this to me? Okay. You would, and you. Mm. What's happening? What you would want to do is you would. Is you would want to find a place on top of a mountain to get the best view. I'm just showing you guys. Like, that's what I did in my Let's Play series. Don't worry, I'm going to be still be doing other episodes of that. Don't worry. But. Okay, that's you then. You've got to be kidding me. Okay. I am so sorry. I know it's doing this. I'm going to get this stuff fixed, I promise. Okay, let's see. Maybe make that a little bit. And another tip is to find the style you want, of course, but, like, okay. So, me okay, stop it. So then, you go down. I'm getting real mad right now. It might be a little bit of lag in this video. I don't know why my OBS studio is doing this, but it's fine. I think oh, if it's fine with you, that's, that's all that matters. Okay, so then what you want to do is you want to make your wall, which is like this. It, it doesn't matter if you do it like mine, but you can if you want. Don't get me wrong, because, you know, I'm a really good builder, but, like, you know what I mean? So, like, just do... I'm not going all out, 
but because it's just a quick video i wouldn't say quick i don't know how long it's gonna take we're already five minutes into the recording oh oh god i gotta gotta pick up the pace you know what i mean okay so you got your windows and there's another thing you can do to make your builds better is you can use stairs to do it so I'll show you what I mean by that after I'm done with this it, it increases how it the the style the style what, what am I saying you know what just forget I said ever said that okay so you have this and what I mean by using stairs is doing this let me grab some grass blocks so you go choose the stairs you want to use and then do this I'm not putting a bunch of detail into it because it's just a video but yeah you see that I mean of course you see that but unless you're blind which I'm sorry I didn't mean it like that um um don't take that offensive sorry Okay, do that. Make the window. Or, or we can start changing it up a little bit. We can. Okay. What are you, stop it. Why are you doing this to me? Come on, stop! Okay, there we go. Don't mind that. It's just I'm about to. Oh, you don't even know. I mean, unless you do, but you just build up. You build that, and then what? I, then you go over here. Then basically keep repeating that. Or you can just change up the style window. Like I said, I'm not going all out because, you know, I'm a pretty good builder if I do say so myself. But, like, you know what I mean? Okay, let's just, I'll just skip to the part. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I am back. And I am just going to continue. So, let's go. I know I said I was going to do this off cut, but. I just feel like it would be better for you guys to see me. So, like, yeah. That. I mean, it's not gonna look the best because I mean there's a there's floor outside of the window like who would want to just look at that but that's that's fine we're almost done anyway so we're with this part at least what am I doing why would I just place grass randomly grass I'm getting my words mixed up not again. I don't know why I keep doing this. It only does this when I record. Maybe it's, it's because I'm moving quick and it has the time to transfer to my video capture card. I'm not sure. I'm done with this. I'm about to... Nothing because I can't do anything about it. Okay. Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm done. I'm, I'm actually done. Okay. There. And now we have that part done. Now, the next tip is to make your roofs like this. This. Like that. 
see there. But then what you need to do is place your your stairs like this. Actually what you do is you leave these out and put blocks in the middle of them. That's what you're supposed to do at least. Unless you want to get, I said it's your own style, it's totally customizable. You, it's not, you don't have to listen to every tip I do, it's just what I know from experience. So. So it's starting to get a little bit of shape. Okay. You know what? I'm sorry you guys have to go through this. But it's just it just makes me mad. Seriously. Well, I'm gonna just go from here because I haven't counted the blocks, which isn't the best thing exactly to do when you're building things like this, but um yeah, also, that's another tip. Don't do that. Don't count blocks. No, no, no. I mean, count your blocks. Count your blocks. That's a tip. That's a tip. Remember that. Remember that. See, in my Let's Play series, or, yeah, I didn't really add all of the detail because it's harder in survival. I mean, if you're an absolute boss... And you just farm these every single day, you're, you're just a god at the game, seriously. And then you can build this, look, especially your first week, do you know how long I made that Let's Play series for? Do this. As long as you do this, everything should be fine. Thanks. Okay, that's nothing. If you hear something, it's nothing, okay? Okay, so that is there. Okay, so we just build up more. I mean, this probably w this would take way more time unless you're green or something. But building. <gasps> no! Building is survival. But you've got to be kidding me. Well, you know, those two things I was talking about, I'm probably not going to get to those in this video because, well, the lag, um, I don't, I, do I really need to explain? The lag is so horrible. I'm not sure. I would, I'll feature one redstone contraption, but then I'll do tutorials on them in a different video. If you're if you're Mojang or anyone watching this that's a pro builder or something, don't get mad at me. I, I've only been playing for a year, okay? Like, thanks, mom. Thanks. Okay, so we do that. Then another level like this. Thank you, Mom. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Oi! Who who's that? Who's that? Um um Yeah, 
that's me. That's me. Definitely me. Okay, so we do that. And then we just build these across. I mean, that's not all you do, of course, but, like, I'm not going full two-story cabin-like stuff. But this is pretty much, it's not it. But look at how that looks. That looks sick. See, but the thing is, the thing is, yeah, all right, all right, you have to break these windows to get out. I mean, you don't have to, but I would do that if I were you. So you just do that, and then I do. So I block this off. I mean, I, I, oh, I was about to say it's two blocks high, but if it was, I would be mad. Anybody like that would be mad, but like. And to make your base cooler, what you do is you add stairs to it. Make a second story. Right, 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 right. Like, yeah. I do that all the time. I definitely, I definitely did, did do it. Like, what do you mean? Like, okay, so you can customize this as much as you want. But what I'm going to do for the time being is I'm going to use maybe I'm not sure this might be a huge mistake that I'm making that I didn't know before but you just oh no I'm gonna find strict oak wait hold up <gasps> they don't have strict oak logs do they oak logs oh um yeah what um that was a mistake um Everyone makes mistakes, right? 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 Okay, so we can just do this, right? I like the texture. Oh, you've got... No. No, not right now. Not right now. Okay, do that. What people... What people like to do is they like to put windows in the middle. I don't know why, but... Just, like do it if you want I guess but then you do this then do this and then we can look on the outside right look here it looks it looks wonderful seriously I mean we can add a second story but I mean I'm gonna just go in there and I'm going to just make the back just the back but like okay we can go up here oh no okay that didn't go exactly to point you know we're not gonna make this two stories that's fine we don't need to make it two stories it's perfectly fine that that's just a little design flaw see that's why and another tip another tip is to keep them up like this so if you have two story, make this two story for first. What am I saying? Make the two story first, then make the roof. That's it's better to do it like that. You know what I mean? That there. Bring it up like this, and then bring this up. Wait, hold up! No, no, no. this is where we made the window. Wait, no. Should I do the one now? I mean, there's nothing really much to look at. I mean, except just trees blocking the view. But if you want to make it symmetrical, that, that's totally fine with me. Just do that. Just got it here. Um, that's just my brother. Don't mind him. But we can make a little chest system, which is a redstone contraption I'm going to be showing you guys today. So that's pretty much the house, or the cabin, as fancy people like to say it. Um, uh, that wasn't, that didn't make much sense. Just forget I ever said that, okay? So we just take all this st stuff out, and then what you need to grab are some hoppers, and then chests, 
like this. Then you need redstone comparator, sticky piston, a block of your choice, and then just you can have a lever or you can just do an item thingy thing. You know what I mean? You probably don't, but it's fine, I guess. And then have a dropper. That might be all, but if you didn't know, I am more boy at math. Just kidding, I get hundreds most of the time on my... No, I get hundreds all the time. I miss, I miss, said that. I get hundreds all the time on all my um, math thingies. So you just, it doesn't matter how big your chest is. So what you, you've got to be, stop it. I'm not going to make it sneaky at all. But what you do is, okay. You put a dropper one block behind this chest here. I mean, it kind of messes up the whole thing. But I would, I would suggest you do this. In a basement, if you make a basement in your house, but you do this, get out, that's right, okay, so then you place a dropper face up, then you put a hopper face into the chest and a hopper face into this dropper. So first, what you do, okay, oh yeah, this is Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So, it might not work in Java, I'm not sure. But don't get mad at me if it doesn't work in Java. Because I didn't test. Because I don't have Java Minecraft. But, that's fine. So, that connects there. Then what you do, is you put, wait, yeah. So, you put it like this, you get, oh, yeah, that's right, I knew I'd forget something. So, get your redstone torch. Grab that. And replace that with, I guess. Yeah, replace that with the dropper. Because you won't need that anymore. Or you could just keep it in your in your inventory. But that that should lock the hopper. Let me let me check. Wait, the, actually, no, I don't have to check. Because I'm a redstone pro. Remember that. Okay, so then when you flick this lever, this will turn off. Go into this, right? So then you put, you put it, you can just put this into a block, and make it do go down, you do that, put it like into a repeater, and then you can just use a sticky piston somewhere. Just, I see, I'm sorry about this, it's just... It's just, it's underground. Like, the basement would be better. But I didn't make, make the basement because that would have been a little bit too long. But when you turn, the items in here will flow into here. Which will make this, which if I do this correctly, which will make this fire. You know, you forget about this part. Just forget about that part. Okay, that'll make this whole thing fire once that activates. Unless you have the block moved, which you're going to put under. I know, you, look, I'm going to do a real clear tutorial in another video. But when that is activated, that's the only way that will actually be able to fire once there's something in there. So you put that in there. So then what you do is you come to your sticky piston redstone put your redstone down and then i'm not gonna be very like secretive like i just said but you're gonna bring this up this up to there so then when you put an item it oh i forgot gotta connect that into there wait no i didn't forget why would i forget that that's the, that's the basic that's basic redstone like if if you don't know that like Um, I, okay, let's just, we'll just get off that topic. 
So right now, this hopper is locked, which means you can put anything in here. Once you activate this, it will activate, it will deactivate this hopper, which will allow items to go through into here, right? So that'll be powered. So that means when it goes through, this, this, this needs to be in, into redstone torch. So this is up. So this is in the state. Wait a minute. Hold up. Oh no. Wait a minute. This doesn't need to be here. I think. See, look. I'm not in, like complete with it. I just gotta process things in my mind because I'm getting really mad at this switch. So I can't think. Okay, let's see. Now I would have to have an automatic switch which would shut this part of the system off. So after that is done, we can put this into a comparator. Ooh. No, that would compare the redstone signal to that. Okay, I guess we'll have to go a different route. Okay, I um don't mind this, okay? Or actually we could just yeah, that'll work. You know, I, I'm just confused, okay? I'm sorry. It's not a, I've told you, I'm going to do another video on this. So then that goes through. This is in motion. That's locked. Oh, thank goodness I'm not in survival. Okay, so that's in its locked state. You deactivate it. It's in its unlocked state. So it will go into there. And this needs to be off. Like that. This needs to be. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. So this needs to be off, which means this won't fire. So when I activate it, this should go up while the items are in there. Everything will fire back through here, fire everything, and then this whole thing will deactivate. There you go. That's how it works. So we just. You pretty much just do it, pretty much. So use this. I'm pretty proud of my work, even though it took a little bit. But like, that's that happens with developments. So, it, for example, if I grab some stuff like some armor from my from my um creative menu. You know, gotta go a full netherite, you know what I mean? Like, y you can't go wrong with a netherite. Unless you don't enchant it, then that's a different story. Okay, so then you do this. Let's see. Nope, that is in its unlocked state. Means. Yeah, so then we put this in here. So then. When you flick this, everything will leave the chest. Everything will then go into here. And then nobody will know about it. But then when you flick this, everything kicks into action. And then your items are back into the chest. Ha, voila, voila. So, like, you impressed yet? Just forget I said that. Let me just grab this stuff, right? And just patch this up. This will be the end of the video. Don't leave yet. Don't leave. Okay. Just don't leave yet. Please. Okay. Put this here. Don't worry. This is going to be very quick. Very quick. I mean, this is it a lot of space so like just in case like I'm gonna have backup face in my secret suitcase I'm not 11 not 11 you know I'm edge of 47 the legend the legend yeah
Day 47, wedding is back. Did you know you guys clapped? Oh, yeah. Sit back and relax as you clap, clap, okay, you go on that. So you just push your blocks like that and then keep doing it like this. I don't know why this is happening to me, but it's fine. So this is very good. That contra redstone contraption is very good if someone is trying to come and hunt you down and you have all your armor. So then when you have a secret input, you can press that. Everything leaves out of your chest so nobody can see anything. I mean, I can improve upon the design, but I'll do that in a different video. Get out. Do you know what? Fine, you can live in here. But, let me just get this. Okay, put this in here. I didn't get to do the card reader today, which I will do in a different video. But, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit that bell. Remember to stay legendary. I'm out. See ya! I hope my videos encourage you and brighten your day. Well, hmm, let's see. Let's go. Bye.